Hey everybody, Naomi Michaels and my son Jonathan. Say hey. Hello. Hey, um, how are y'all? Um, so, I'm um, gonna clear that off and we're gonna talk to y'all tonight about our quick cooker. Um, how's everybody doing? How's Wednesday? We have just a few more days till Friday. It's hump day, yay. Um, everybody had a good Wednesday? Um, okay, so quick cooker. We have in here, um, John has already pre-made our rotini. We picked this up from, Ch uh, I think it was Costco. We're gonna try these rotini. What is that? Banza? Rotina. You think it's Banza? Banza? But it says, hey Kelly, it, it says it's made from chickpeas. And so we're gonna check this out. We have only done one. We usually double this, but for y'all, we just made the regular portion. Okay, so this is just something I picked up offline, and it's a, a quick macaroni and cheese. So we put this on for how long, John? Seven minutes. Okay, so good thing about Pamper Chef Quick Cooker is you can program it. So you can come down here, you can push custom, time, and then you can put in however many minutes you want to cook it. Now if you're doing chicken, it has a chicken, it has the poultry. Um, I do um, chicken wings and I do it for 15 minutes, I buy the bag from Costco, dump the whole bag in there, and walk away or go to church, and then when I come home, they're totally ready. Fall off the bone ready, they're delicious. Um, it has roast, and then you know you can do your beans. It can do grains as well, like if you like quinoa, barley, I think quinoa is one minute, is all it takes to pressure cook your quinoa. Rice is like just a couple minutes, it's, it, it does cut down on your cooking time. So, tonight, the cool thing about the quick cooker, it has these handles, you can pick it up. It's super light, you pick it up, and, um, and then our vent is on the top. And the vent shoots the, you're gonna see it, um, the steam away from you, so you don't get burnt. We don't wanna get burnt. So I'm gonna let the steam out, um, so, it's, um, so it has a steam release. Also, you can just push this down and it'll do it automatically. I always put a dishcloth over it because I don't, my cabinets aren't the best anyway. So, yeah. Ah, yeah. Okay. Hey, Kelly, can you make brownies in that too? Uh huh. You can make brownies. There's chocolate pudding you can make in it as well. Um, Let's see. And you're not a mac and cheese fan. I am so sorry, but that's okay. My girlfriend at Nittier. Um, hey Angie, how are you? Welcome. We are just let we are letting all the steam out. Um, it's totally safe, and it will not it will not unlock until the steam is all out. And um, one other thing, when you use the quick cooker, I think you can see it. So we did it for six minutes, but the long, it sits here, it's beeped, it's ready to go. It will count down, it will actually count up the minutes it's been sitting. So it's been sitting for seven minutes. Okay, we're totally done. And we're gonna take this off, and then John's gonna throw together this macaroni and cheese. Oh, nice. Okay, so this is an experiment. We have not used the chickpea pasta before so it's a little bit more runny but that's okay throw it in so with this macaroni and cheese recipe you put in all the spices into the bowl of the mac and cheese you might want to use the spatula but anyway he's my mac and cheese guy like um we went to a new year's party john made all the macaroni and cheese okay yeah i'm into cheese so much oh we all love grilled cheese oh yes um, yeah, so, um, anyway, so the spices were cooked into the noodles mm -hmm. and then we're just adding the cheese and the cream cheese and I think we have milk, milk as well and this is my sous chef, it's great, I can stand here and talk to y'all while he does this. Um, yeah, okay, well I'm just going to tell y'all, okay. So, has anybody, okay, Kelly and Angie, Angie, you already had your party, thank you, and we had a great party, it was fun. Kelly, we're going to have a party, right? 
Um, you just need to text me. I think we said next month, right? So looking forward to that. And um, now we're adding the cheese. And the good thing is with this, um, the quick cooker, I'm just not worried about it. Um, like I think I told y'all on the last show, in Angie's show, that the old quick cookers just scared me to death. I would never use them, right? You didn't see them. You haven't seen them. But my grandmother had one, my mom had one, and no thanks. I don't wanna do that. I don't wanna blow up the house. So, so, um, so are there any plans for this weekend? Anybody, everybody? We don't have any plans. My husband actually was supposed to come home Friday, y'all. He was supposed to come home Friday and the boat got delayed. So, go Navy. The needs of the Navy. So he won't be home till like probably Sunday or Monday. All right, we're looking good. It's kind of, it's really creamy yeah. this time. Yeah. So, um, might want to start with real pasta noodles. I don't know, this was an experiment. We wanted to see what they would do. Um, yeah, it's, it's really creamy. Strange. Now, the one thing you can do, um, if you love uh, macaroni and cheese, you can throw this into um, a pot or a bowl, it doesn't matter, and then throw it in the oven and get it crispy. Okay, Kelly, we're gonna do your party. Okay, yeah. Yeah, that's, that's great. We can totally do that. I'm excited. I'm gonna actually tag a few people tonight who I haven't seen much in the party, and we're hopefully gonna get some more um, people interested. How about that? Or just, you know, involved. Oh my goodness, 19? Woo! Okay, that's a little cold. Is your, is that your cook for Mike? Yeah, Angie, this is my son, John. He's 17. He says he wants to take all my Pamper Chef goodies to college with him. But he's going to be living in the dorm and they don't, you know, he's not going to have a kitchen. So, yeah. All right. So, are we ready? Mm -hmm. Okay, y'all. I'm going to pick this up. Probably shouldn't. It's really not that hot. You kind of think it would be. Um, yes. So, um, it's a little runnier than normal, okay? But, it's if you nice. like... You know, um, mac and cheese, it's it's gonna be good and cheesy. So, um, yeah, I'm gonna give you the bowl and you can just pour it right on in there. He makes a great sous chef, don't you think? I think he does. Lately, he's been in the kitchen cooking more, which I love. I love to have him in here. Okay, so I'm gonna sign off and we're gonna pour this in the bowl and we might throw it in the, the under the broiler just to get it a little bit crispier but that quicker would be so dorm. It would be dorm friendly. I'm actually going to ask. He can't. I think he has a microwave. Do you have a microwave? Uh, it's in the- uh, And a fridge? Rec center. Rec oh, okay. On the floor, so. So maybe they share. He could keep it in there. It would be great. He could have everybody over for mac and cheese. Okay, so we're gonna sign off. Y'all, thanks for showing up. Um, Angie, Kelly, it's been so fun. It always is. Um, okay. So it's hump day, we can make it Friday, and hopefully we'll talk to y'all tomorrow. Y'all have a great night, bye.